quick video to show you how uh, to set up MTCD tools. Uh, so right here I have my Malay Scrum on my Deseda Hunt audio unit. Now you can see when I'm playing, this does nothing, right? So you hear it beeping. So if you hear it beeping, that means the head unit is recognizing the button, it's just not assigned to anything. So we can do something about that. If it already has an assignment, MTCD tools won't work on top of it or it might, but so just go to Google, look for MTCD tools. There we go. So we'll look for this GitHub, right? Uh, it's on XDA, links to this one, but I know this is where you go. I'll have a link in the description how to do it. Uh, so you just want your MTCD tools APK. Alright, so they're downloaded. Now we're going to open it. And we do want to install it. Open it. Not sure if I lost you on that step. I'm gonna open it. I right, see. So you can donate PayPal. To this guy, I did already. I'll donate again though. All kinds of stuff you can do in here. I don't use all these features. All I use is create a new binding. So uh, you hear it? Oh, sorry. No. Create a new action. All right. A new key action and what I want is play pause you can name it whatever you want you can name it taco if you want right it doesn't matter so all it's doing is the functionality it's just for you to remember it I'm gonna call it taco all right so now we go to binding and there's taco right so now I'm gonna obtain my key sequence so now I press my key. So now I'm going to press this guy here. You can see he recognized it. And I'll save it. Save that. And now watch what happens. So now when I press this button, it should start playing my song on Google Play Music. Right? So there's a button. Going to press it. And watch it. Let's see if we can get all this in one screen. Okay. Now, pause the music again, right? Uh -huh. Off. Uh -huh. Off. See how great that is? Okay. Great tool. Really updates functionality. Now, you will have an ever present notification here, but if you don't want that, you can just hold on this guy, go to your info, and just block notifications from this app. Now it's gone and my play pause still works. Alright, so now it's really adding a lot of functionality to my state of hot audio unit. So, great app.